Now hold on, we it's are getting more tough. news. We're getting oh. more news across the uh, across the Twitter w- wires. Uh, a reporter, reporter I worked with actually in the the World Championship mix zone, uh, Evelyn Wada on Twitter. She just tweeted this quote tweet to the AIU tweet announcing the suspension. Uh, this is what she said: Salwi Nasser's manager Pineda says he received him read received info from his athlete. She missed two tests in 2019. And then during her holidays in Nigeria, early 2020, she missed a flight arriving late to her hotel. Anti-doping officials missed her at the hotel, producing her third missed test. Now, if that is true, um, that to me, I mean, I could be wrong, but that takes the likelihood of a, of a stripped, I could be wrong, but a, of a stripped metal makes it much more unlikely i could be wrong there but i i I, that doesn't that 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 makes me think that this is one got a great shot to get knocked down to just one year if not completely knocked down uh but also the 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 i the likelihood that she gets stripped of a medal is to me much less likely that being said though just missing two tests in 2019, a year where she ran 48-14, not a good look. And she'll need to have explanations for those things uh, to to get her penalty reduced. Yeah, no, but that third missed test, you would think, this is what I like, like about systems. Hey, my flight was delayed, and that's why I'm not there. They literally can open up their phone see if she's lying be like oh yeah their flight was delayed three hours that's why she's literally not here okay i will just come back in three hours like yeah. that is the ultimate like you can prove that she can't you're 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 at the will of an airplane right you can't like control where you are in an airplane so that's like the ultimate like proof that like you weren't trying to dodge a test in my mind yeah We'll see. That's that's what she's saying, and and you know, like I said, we can believe her on her word right right now. I still think missing the two tests. Uh, I remember when it was talking about when the the Coleman reports were coming out. You know, there were certain athletes saying like, "You'd have to be an idiot to miss two tests." Like, how does that happen? And I mean, I'm not using the word "idiot" is a strong word, obviously, and I don't mean it in that sense, calling these athletes idiots, but it's suspicious even for her to have done that and knowing that she was on the bubble there it 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 at at best it it shows a level of recklessness that is concerning and uh you know i i i don't know exactly i know that you know they these testing officials have things to do and they say if you're going to be here you know you need to be here at this time but i would think that that a a delayed flight or whatever it was um would uh or she miss missing a flight i would think there would be some level if that was true if that was exactly what happened and it was all with good intent that there would be some level of forgiveness there i i just i i don't know man that that that, that's what she's going to say but she's going to need to provide more details there um because when you know I don't know when you know you're you're sitting there with two misses already. Uh, I'm going to need better reasoning than that to just all of a sudden exonerate her. 